Hey guys, it's Amber. So today is time for another update on my Pen That Palette. So I have been panning for the year the Naked Urban Decay Palette. And technically since it's like halfway of the year is gone, I should be halfway through this palette. More than halfway the year is gone. But I kind of had a little bit of a struggle in July because it was my birthday month. I bought the Carly Bible Palette. I bought the Jaclyn Harrell Morphe Palette. I got the NYX Palette for my Ulta gift. So I haven't been using this as much as I should be, but I'm bringing it back. I'm giving it more some use. And yes, I still hit pan another color. So <laughs> let's go ahead and jump in. So first off, my goal for this palette is I want to pan half of the shadows. So I would like to use up as many as possible, but just hitting pan on at least half the shadows is what my goal is. My goal isn't to empty out every shadow entirely because I want to get use out of this palette, but I don't want to completely neglect and only use this palette since I have such a big makeup collection. I like to review other things and do different looks. So that's the goals that work for me. So, so far I have pan on four shades. So the newest color I've hit pan on is sidecar so a lot of you guys called that that would probably be next and you're right so virgin sin naked and sidecar all have a pretty decent amount of pan in there and you can see i've widened out some of the other pans as well and just as a comparison i'll show you my palette when i first started here is my last update and now here's now so still getting some good progress the next shadow i'm going to be working on i've actually started using half baked again more i thought i might not hit pan on this one so it's kind of a toss up between toasted and half baked are my next two that i would like to hit pan on and then buck i definitely think that eventually i could hit pan on buck as well but yeah these obviously are my most used shades so i'm gonna have to work a little harder to get pan on these ones but I'm still happy with my progress so far. I definitely think that Smog, Dark Horse, Hustle, Creed, those are some of those shades that are a little harder. I think those shades are good for even one shadow looks or just putting Buck in the crease and then making a smoky eye with just Smog or Dark Horse. I've never been as drawn to Dark Horse and Hustle. For whatever reason they tend to look a little bit more muddy on my lid so I just I'm not drawn to those colors as much and I haven't been doing much with creep or gunmetal but it's also been summer so I haven't really been drawn to wearing like a dark silver smoky eye so I think once fall hits more October time I'll dive into these darker colors a little bit more but I'm still wanting to hit pan on half baked or toasted. Do you think I can do it? I'll probably give myself another two months see how I do so let's see it's August now September October so yeah so in October We'll see what I hit pan on, and then I'll probably start uh, going into some of these deeper shades. Overall, I'm still really happy with my progress considering that I had so much going on this month. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short and sweet update, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!